In this lesson, I'm going to show you how easy it is to create moody, dramatic images with some color grading inside of On One Photo Raw. So the first thing that I like to do when it comes to creating mood and drama is to bring in contrast, especially if the image is a little bit flat or dull. Now there's a couple of different ways that you can do that. First way is just to go into the develop tab and just use your tone and color section and simply just pull up on the contrast slider. Does a really great job of bringing in some contrast and already it's looking a little bit more dramatic and a little bit more moody. What I like to do so that I can sort of completely control the amount of contrast and mood and even some other things when it comes to tone is I like to add in contrast using my curves filter. So let's go into the effects tab. I'm going to add a filter and I'm going to add curves. Now inside of the tone curve, it's really easy to use. All we're going to do is we're going to drop a point down on this line here. And if we want to brighten up that tone, we'll pull that point up. And if we want to darken that tone, we'll pull the point down. And within the tone curve here, it starts out completely dark on the bottom, on this bottom left section. And then as we move up, it just brightens up in tones. So we have complete black, shadows, midtones, highlights, and then our whites. So whatever tone we want to brighten or darken, we just drop a point down and then move that point up or down within the tone curve. Now what I like to do is I like to create contrast by creating what's called an S curve. So to create an S curve, I'm going to drop a point within my shadows. I'll just pull that point down a bit. And then I'm going to drop another point near my highlights and my midtones. And I'm going to pull that point up a bit. And you can see we have this nice little S within our tone curve. If we turn this curves filter off and on, it's doing a really great job of bringing in some moody dramatic contrast into our edit here. Now, the next thing I like to do when I'm creating mood or drama is I like to bring in a bit of color grading. 